football season is three months out of the year. It's, it's the other nine months that training for that whole three month season that separates you from other teams in the state. Well, Troy, Troy's a special athlete and he's been training for a long time now, so he's got a pretty big training history behind him, okay? So now we, from, from, with that, from that standpoint, we're moving into being very specific in how he moves on the field and how he moves, one, as a quarterback and two, as a linebacker. Uh, so we have to do a lot of different movements and exercises which incorporate the same movements that he goes through on the field during games and practices. They really combine the perfect amount of running, agility, lifting, combinations of things, so you're improving of all aspects of your game. You could, you could be the best lifter in the world, but if you can't cut side to side, what are you going to do? So I think that's one of the things that I've really benefited here with just my overall mobility, flexibility, and just the combination of all these lifts. I like to power clean because it's it's one of those things where I could just keep doing it and doing it and doing it and even if I fail I'll go back down, I'll hit that weight. And it's just something I feel good doing. Squat, I love to squat and bench but it's just you don't feel the same like explosion through your entire body and there's nothing, there's nothing that compares to how I'm going to feel tomorrow after all those power cleans and not wanting to get out of bed. So that's my number one. Um, in Troy's case, sometimes his workouts are anywhere from you know, three to five days a week, sometimes more. Uh, sometimes we're doing two a days right now where we're coming in in the morning and hurting, hitting certain elements of the workout, getting some recovery in between, and then coming back after that. Uh, and, and that's typically how we work with our higher level athletes and, and train them to get ready for the upcoming season.